Uh, Alright guys, so I'll quickly show you guys how to be able to cancel uh, like an auto renewal uh, like auto renewal subscription on WPS, okay? So one thing is actually needed a trial version of WPS to just edit one document at a time Alright, so when I got it then uh, I kind of like skipped So can you see that all of a sudden uh the trial process have now expired and they're now trying very hard to actually what uh debit my bank card do you understand and this is actually causing a lot of problems so is um uh if they continue like this and the transaction keep failing uh, my usd card might be deactivated all right so i want to actually deactivate the subscription so if you want to deactivate the subscription you have to just come to wps so when it comes to the WPS, make sure that the email logs in here is actually the email you used in creating the pro plan. Do you understand? So you just click here. Why is it not clicking? Like see this top here. Okay. I just need to bring it. Uh, then it comes to my subscriptions. So when it comes to your subscriptions, it will automatically go to the web version. Now wait for it to load up. Now, when it loads up, you can see, all right, this is my email, GGMBBS, you can confirm here, all right. So, if you come down here, they say that the thing that is currently active on your WPS is what? The WPS Pro one-year plan, all right. I just activated 29th November. Oh, 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 oh sorry, it, was, it expired 29th November. So, you click on cancel cancel subscription has been turned off all right and when you renew you don't have any valid subscription all right so they will stop what um they will stop disturbing you with all those trying to debit your stuff and all of that okay so that's how to do it